So the gym I go to, we have these lockers and for these lockers you need a lock and the lock is supplied by the gym, you can buy it and everyone has the same generic black one. So if you lock your locker and you don't really know where it was after you've come back from doing your thing in the gym, you have a problem. So since everyone has the same black one, I thought I'd figured something out by just painting it. I firstly started with masking all the metal parts off that did not need to be painted. Then I just scuffed it up, applied some primer and painted a fancy color. Now I wanted one for myself and my friend that I go to the gym with also wanted one for himself. So I painted two. In this video I will be painting the one for my friend and in the next video I will be painting the one for myself. So after doing all the masking we just give it a quick scuff with some 600 grit, clean it up nicely and apply some plastic and metal primer from Tamiya. So the primer went on nice and even straight out of the can, just shook it up a bit to mix it together and then applied it on the lock itself. After applying this first coat I thought it was enough, it was fully covered and no see-through areas or exposed metal was seen anymore. So after just that first coat I let it dry for about 30 minutes to an hour at room temperature and moved on to painting the base silver for underneath the main color. Since I will be painting this one in a super bright color, I wanted the base to be super bright as well for that color to come out a lot nicer and I wouldn't need as much coats as I would need otherwise. So I applied a quick nice silver base just in one coat and then moved on to the main color itself. So with the base now painted in silver, I let that dry for about 5 minutes and moved on to part 1 of this paint job. And that part 1 is just a silver metallic from Ferrari and after just applying one or two light coats I let it sit for 5 minutes in between and applied a second coat. After that second coat it was nicely covered, no more see through areas to the silver and it was also a nice even coverage all over. So with that first coat done I set it aside for about 5 minutes and applied a second coat in the same manner as I did for this first coat. Then again let it sit for about 5 minutes and moved on to the second stage which was a yellow pearl to be added on top of this base coat. This was also applied in two light coats just making sure I cover everything, letting it dry for about 5 minutes in between and then moving on to letting it dry for about 30 minutes in total and then mix up some 2k diamond clear 
and finish it off making it a lot nicer and shinier. So the first coat was applied, I let it dry for 5 minutes, moved on to doing this a second time and then letting it sit for about 30 minutes, mix up some clear and gave it two nice coats of this diamond finish clear from Zero Paint to protect the paint and also give it a nice fancy looking shine to it. So after the first coat, just as usual, I set it aside for about 5 minutes and let it cure for a bit, applied a second coat and then finished it off. After that I let it sit for about 3 days and then gave it to my friend so it could be used in the gym and he knew exactly which locker was from him.